Hi, you're watching Wink Sound, and in this video, you'll learn how to adjust the grid size of your sessions in GarageBand. The grid size determines how each measure is subdivided. If you notice on your timeline, you have bars. One, two, three, four, five, and so on. Each bar is then divided into beats. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Adjusting the size of the grid could come in handy when moving either regions or MIDI notes around. If we open the piano roll by double clicking on the MIDI region, we'll see below that these MIDI notes snap to the grid at different values. So if I were to grab this note here and move it to the right, you see how it automatically snaps to the next quarter beat. If for instance, we'd like to move this note instead of a full quarter note, just an eighth note over, we'd have to adjust the size of the grid. To do so, go to the right hand side of your timeline and there's a ruler. Click on it. You'll see a series of note values. These note values will then subdivide the grid. So for instance, if we choose eighth notes, we'll notice that now the grid is divided into eighth notes. And when we move this note over, the MIDI note then snaps to the closest eighth note value on the grid. Join the conversation by following Wink Sound on Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube to keep up with everything you need to know about music and audio technology. 